Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Hi. How was your day so far? Me. Tired. <laughs> well, that's life. You have to, to start uh, getting supplements. Yeah. <laughs> it's good to, if you don't get enough sun, because we used to, to avoid a, uh, solar exposition, uh, you have to get vitamin D intake. That's good to improve your immune system. And if you had the chance to get some some sunlight is better before nine or 10, okay? And don't get a shower or don't, don't get a shower, yes, or a bath after the exposition to the sun because the, the skin needs some time in order to form vitamin D naturally. And if you uh, wash with soap and water, you uh, stop the process. That's why when, when you put a, a little baby uh, to have sun bath, is after uh, his bath. You first you bath the child and then you put it in the sun. Because in that way the skin is uh, processing the light from the sun and turn it to vitamin D to make the bones stronger. It helps with the calcium. Do you know that? Lo sabían? O no me entendieron? <laughs> okay. Now. O sea, la vitamina D se forma en la piel naturalmente con los rayos del sol. Pero después de estar a los rayos del sol, usted no tiene que bañarse inmediatamente. Es mejor que usted primero se bañe y después se asolee. Porque si usted se baña, o sea, si usted se pasa agua y jabón, eh, impide que la, que la piel haga su... su proceso de, de, de convertir los rayos solares en vitamina D. Yeah. Another good source of vitamin D is if you buy eh, mushrooms. Si usted compra, este, ¿cómo se llama? Champiñones o hongos de los comestibles. y los, los pone a solear durante unos 10 minutos. Después los corta y, y, y los cocina normal, como los va a cocinar. Se los come. 
Entonces, el, 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 el hongo absorbe los rayos solares y los convierte en vitamina D también. Ok. Now, education is not feeling a pale, but the lighting of a fire. William Butler Yeats. Education is not feeling a pale, but the lighting of a fire. Okay. La educación no es llenar un balde, sino que es la luz de un fuego. Okay. Remember that we were studying uh, good plus like or love plus the verb and the complement. I would like to go to her new house. I would love to go to her new house. Okay. Remember that we can use like or love and it's almost the same. And uh, for refusing an invitation, uh, you can say, I love to go to her new house, but I can't. I would like to go to her new house, but I can't. Okay, and now we're starting uh, section five. And in this lesson, participants will be able to listen to a conversation about families using present continuous, okay? Now listen. Asking about families, part A, listen and practice. Tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Wow, and what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Uh, no, my sister's away. She's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. Can you tell me now where Rita's parents live? Okay, listen again. Practice it in class. Asking about families. Part A. Listen and practice. Tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Wow. And what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Uh, no, my sister's away. She's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. Can you tell me now where? Okay. Now, repeat after me. Tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Tell me about yeah. your brother yeah. and yeah. about your brother and sister. Well, my sister works for the government. Well, my sister Oh, what does she do? Oh, oh what, what does she, she do? do? I'm not sure. I'm not, I'm sure. not sure. I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. She's working, She's working on a very secret project, very right, secret now. project right, now. right now. Right now. Wow. 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 And what about your brother? And what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. She's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet what? them? What an interesting, interesting family. family. Can, can I meet them? them? Oh, no. Oh, oh no. no. My sister is away. She's not oh. working in the United States this month. She's not she is working not in, the in the United States, States this month. month. And your brother? 
and uh, he's traveling in the Amazon. He's traveling in the Amazon. Okay. Now, uh, volunteers. Sofia and Jancy. Tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Wow, and what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What, what an interesting family. Can I meet them? Uh, no, my sister is away. She's not working in the United States right now, this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. Okay. Now, thank you, other two volunteers. Carmen Lisette. And Katia Elizabeth. Tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She is working on a very secret project right now. Um, I can see. Uh, well, wow, and what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. I can meet him? Oh, no, my sister is away. She's not working the United States this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. Okay, remember that when it's a question is, can I? No, I can. Can uh, I yes, meet okay. them? Can I meet them? Can I meet them? Uh, because I don't see very well because he's in the cell phone. <laughs> oh, <Sorry>. my darling. <laughs> uh, you may turn the cell phone instead of having a, a right. And, and, and make it a little bit uh, bigger. Instead of having it here. <laughs> yes. Yes, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Now, uh, other two volunteers. Okay, Rafael and Jessica. Tell me about your brother and sister, Rafael. Well, my sister worked for the government. Oh, what does she do? I am not sure she is working on very secret project right on now. Wow, and what about your brother? She's building fine photograph. Wildlife. 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 She's, she's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Mm, no, my sister is all, she's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He is traveling in the Amazon. Okay, thank you very much. Now, Carmen Lisette and who else? Yo lo acabo de leer, teacher, pero si quieres lo vuelvo a leer. Ay, como tiene la manita levantada. Ya. Ay, perdón. <laughs> Me enganchó. <laughs> Dije, yo se quiere retachar. Another two volunteers, please. 
Okay, Natalie. And one more. Okay, uh, Lorena Reyes. Now, Natalie first and then Lorena. Okay, uh, tell me about your brother and sister. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? What does she do? I'm not sure. She is working on a very secret project right now. Wow. And what about your brother? He is wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Um, no, my sister is away. She's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He is traveling in the Amazon. Okay, now let's listen to the rest of the story, okay? And the teacher here is asking you, is asking you something about their parents, where they live. Can you tell me now where Rita's parents live? What do they do? Type your answers in our discussion box. Page 31, exercise three, part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. Where do Rita's parents live? What do they do? So what about your parents, Rita? Where do they live? They live in Texas. Oh, where in Texas? In Austin. It's a small city, but it's very nice. Are they still working? Oh yes, my mother is teaching at the university there. And my father is a carpenter. Okay. Now, let's see. Remember that here, asking about families, when you finish, uh, when you finish, When you finish there, you add your comment because they are asking, they are asking a, and you have to answer. It is a discussion because they say discussion box. Then here as a title, I suggest you to put your name. And then you answer. The, the two questions is, where do they live? They, you may say, they live in Austin, comma, Texas. Okay. And the other question is, what do they do? Uh, her mother is a teacher at the university and her father is a carpenter. Okay, then You publish it. You put this, send, and VR, okay? And then you have it there. Because every time when they ask you to answer in the discussion box, you do this procedure, okay? 
No lo voy a enviar porque no soy, no soy alumna. Then, we have the knowledge check. Okay. Look at Sam's family tree. How are these people, people, aquí está mal escrito, es people, people related to him? Write the space, says, write the answer on the spaces provided. You just need to type the name, not a sentence. Do not include the period, okay? Now, look, how they are related to Sam. Okay, this is Sam. Okay, this is Sam. Sam and Jean seems to be brothers. There are sons of Chris and Sarah. And their grandparents are Andy and Marta, okay? So Andy is grandfather and Marta is? Hello? Grandmother. Grandmother, okay? Grandmother. Now, Chris is? Sam's? Pa father. Father. And Sarah is his mother. Mother. Okay. Andy and Marta have also a uh, Manuel. Okay. So Donna is married to Manuel. She is an aunt. Aunt in law. And Manuel is his uncle. Uncle. Okay. Sam uh, is Sam uh, himself. And Jim is <coughs> brother. Brother. brother okay. Brother. Yumiko is sister. No. Sam's um, wife. Uh, his wife. wife. His wife. 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 Okay. His wife. wife. He's the husband. Okay. Wife. And Lisa's is Jim. Jim's wife. 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 She wife. is sister-in-law of Sam. Sister-in-law. Sister-in-law. O sea, es eh, hermana por las leyes. O sea, así se dice. Okay. And Teresa is Donna's and Manuel's daughter. So she is his cousin. 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 Okay. Now, Jim and Lisa had two brothers, two, two, two uh, children. Kelly is Sam's niece. Niece. And uh, what's his name? Bro. Jimmy? Or, yes, Jimmy, no? Is yes. uh, his nephew, okay? Yes, Jimmy is his nephew. Okay, now let's answer. Andy is Sam's grandfather and Marta is his Grandmother. 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 Okay, now Chris is Sam's father. 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 Sam's father. Manuel is Sam's uncle. 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 Sam uncle. is married to Yomiko. She is his wife. 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 Why? Okay, Sam has a brother. He is married to Lisa. Lisa is Sam's sister-in-law. 
Eastern. Sister in law. Sister in law. Okay. Mm -hmm. Teresa is the daughter, the daughter of Manuel. She is Sam's cousin. 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 Okay. Now, Jim and Lisa have two babies, Kelly and Jimmy. Kelly is Sam's Niece. 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 And Jimmy is his nephew. Okay. Now let's send this. Okay, correct. Okay, do you have it? Yes. Okay, now Rafael, read number one, please, with the answer. Momento, please. Andy is Sam's grandfather, and Marta is this grandmother. Okay, thank you. Now, uh, Elizabeth del Carmen. Number two. <clears throat> yes. Chris is Sam's father. Thank you. Monica Marisol. Manuel is Sam's uncle. Okay. Sofia. Uh, Sam is married to Jumiko. She is his wife. With Thank wife. you. Wife is okay. <laughs> Ana Margarita. Number five. Yes. Sam, Sam as brother, is married. To Liz, Liz is Sam. He's married to Sister Lisa. in. Uh -huh. Lisa is Sam's. Lisa is Sam, sister in love. Okay, thank you very much. Sister in law. Now, uh, Jancy Andrea. Okay, Teresa is the daughter of Manuel. She is Sam's cousin. Okay. <laughs> Now, uh, Sara Maria. Jean and Lisa have two babies. Kelly and Jean. Kelly is son, um, nice. No. Niece, niece. Niece, niece, niece. And Jimmy is nephew. Is his nephew. Thank you very much. Okay. Now complete. Let's continue. At the end of this lesson, participants will be able to ask and answer questions using the present continuous. Okay. Here I developed what is the present continuous and when do we use it and how, okay? The present continuous is also known as present progressive, okay? Present progressive tense or present continuous is the same. We use the verb to be in present plus the, past, the present participle, okay? Am, is, or are, Plus the present participle, which is also known as gerun or ing form. Okay. The present participle is known as ing form or gerun, as well as present participle. And is this like writing and moving? Okay. Tony is writing a book. It's an ongoing activity now. And he is doing it right now in the present. But he hasn't finished yet. So he is writing it. Okay. In future planet activity, we are moving to Iceland next year. 
That means that they they already had everything in order to move to Iceland, but it's a planned activity, okay, for the future. They are not moving right now. They are going to move, but since it's already set, they may say we are moving because it's something that they will be doing from right now until next year. They have to pack the things, they have to sell the house, they have to buy another house, they have to go from here to there, okay? Now, uh, repeat after me. Are you living at home now? Are you living at home now? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Si se fijan, esto, esto, es verbo to be más sujeto más el verbo en gerundio y el complemento. Pero para hacer las short answers, usted lo puede manejar como que fuera solo con el verbo to be, ¿verdad? Entonces, yes, I am, no, I'm not. Now, uh, repeat after me. Is your sister working for the government? Is your sister working for the government? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. No, she is. No, she is. No, she is not. No, she's no, not. She's not. Are Ed and Jill going to college this year? Are Ed and Jill going, going, going to college this year? Yes, they are. Yes, yes they, they are. are. Yes, they are. Yes, yes they, are. they are. No, they aren't. No, 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 they they are. Are. no, they're not. No, no they're not. not. Where are you working now? Where, where, are, you working? where are you working now? Working now? I'm not working. I'm not, I'm not, working. I'm not working. I need a job. I need, I need a job. Need a job. 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 What is your brother doing these days? What is your brother, is your brother doing today? today? He's traveling in the Amazon. He's traveling in the Amazon. Who are your parents visiting this week? Who are, Who are your, your parents, parents visiting this week? Visiting this week? They are visiting my grandmother. They are visiting my grandmother. Okay. Now, we are going to see the difference between the simple present versus the present continuous. Okay. Uh, in affirmative, the simple present is subject plus verb. She works. Okay? She works. She works. And it present continuous is subject plus verb to be plus verb in ing form. Okay? She is working. She is working. Okay? Now, a structure for just no questions. Verb to be, subject, ing form, complement, and question mark. Are you working as scientists? Repeat. Are you working as a scientist? Is he studying at the university? Is he, 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 he studying at university? 
Are we living in El Salvador? Are we living in El Salvador? Is she eating? Is she, is she eating? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. No, she's not. No, she's not. Are we staying at home? Are we staying at home? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. No, we aren't. No, we aren't. Do you have any doubts up to now? Tienen alguna duda hasta ahorita? No. What's the difference between a present simple and present continuous? In present simple, just use the verb. And present continuous, you use the verb be plus ing form. Excellent. Now, when do we use one and when do we use the other one? The progressive, the continuous is when. <laughs> when it's Cuando... a period of time. Okay, when it's ah, a period of time, una y la... sí. or, or when the thing is, is happening at the same moment. Okay, ah. and yeah. simple present, we use simple present to talk about facts, things that never change, okay, or repetitive actions or habitual actions like your daily routines, okay. We use present, a simple present, to express something that you do during the day, okay? A structure for WH question. The WH word, verb to be, subject, ING form, and complement, okay? Now repeat after me. Where are you working as a scientist? Where are you working, working as a scientist? scientist? What is he studying at university? What is he what studying, is he studying at university? university? How are we living in El Salvador? Where are uh, we are living, living in El Salvador? How? How are we living? How, how are we living in El Salvador? El Salvador? Okay. What is she eating? What is, what is, is she, she eating? eating? She is eating pizza. She, she is, is eating, eating, pizza. eating pizza. Why are we staying at home? Why are we staying at home? Because of the pandemic situation. Because of the pandemic situation. Okay, spelling rules. How do we form the ING? Most verbs have ING. Examples were working by buying, okay? Verbs ending in E, remove the E and add ing. For example, take, taking, write, writing. Verbs ending in one vowel followed by one consonant, double the consonant and add ing. Get, getting, run, running. But open is opening, okay? Note, die is dying, okay? Esta es exception to the rule. Die is dying and lie is lying, okay? O sea, no es como el otro que dice que cuando termina en E, se le cambia la E 
se le requita la E y se le agrega I, e, I, N, G. En este caso, no. En este caso, termina I, E, cambia la I, E por eh, I, Y y se le agrega I, N, G. ¿Ok? Se podría decir que, que, que se le quita la E también, ¿verdad? Se le quita la E, pero en lugar de dejarla eh, I latina, se cambia por Y. ¿Por qué? Porque como le va a agregar I, I, N, G, entonces se oiría muy feo I, I, ¿verdad? I, I. Entonces lo hacen dying. Lying. dying. ¿Ok? Eh, estas, estas spelling rules las van a poner en, en, en práctica con, con, los, con, la, con los verbos que les mandé. Traten de convertirlos a, a ING form, ¿verdad? Las, las, bas, las bases, las, las básicas, o sea, la, de primer, eh, la primera columna. Las van a pasar a ING. En el caso del verbo to be, eh, se pone being, o sea, no se le quita la e, se le agrega b e i n g. Okay? We use the present continuous to talk about things that are happening now to describe an action in progress. Okay? Where John? Where's John? In his room, he is doing his homework. Okay, he is doing at the moment. You're speaking too fast for me. Estás hablando demasiado rápido para mí. Okay, now, eh, eh, Doris Jasmine. Read this, please. Yes, teacher. Uh, tem temporary activities to describe a short term on or temporary situation. Okay. Continue. Y los ejemplos también. Sí. Uh, we're learning about trees this week. Okay. My brother is staying with friends in London. You till he finds some, somewhere to live. Okay. Until he finds somewhere to live. Repeat. Until he finds. Until he finds. Somewhere to live. Don't want to leave. Situations of change. Situation of change. Okay, now, Ana Margarita. Situations of change. Situation of change. Uh -huh. The, the old in the, the song. Layers is greeting. Bigger. Okay, the hole in the ozone layer is getting bigger. Repeat, please. The, the homes in the ozone layer in green is getting is getting is is getting bigger. Bigger. Excellent. Thank you. Now, Jancy, Andrea. The number is pupils of the number the of number of pupils in the school in the is falling. Okay. Now, Katia Elizabeth. ¿Qué significa pupils? Pupils son eh, eh, pupilos, pero en este caso son los alumnos. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Eh, Katia Elizabeth. Future ar arrangement. Uh -huh. We are flying to Spain on a school trip next month. Qué <coughs> galán. <Now, laughs> Jessica Ros Rosibel. Uh, 
Okay, thank you. Now, thanks. Now, any doubts about the present continuous? No doubt. Well, teacher, everything is clear for me. Okay, and the rest? Two. Now, uh, let's see. Okay, everybody says it's clear. Now, let's see if you can use the rules with your irregular list of verbs. Okay, remember be being, just add ing, okay? Now, uh, Monica Marisol, how will you make the ing form for becoming? For become. ¿Cómo? En la, en la, aquí en la. Se ve la lista. No se ve la lista. Ticho. Ah, permítame. Vale, aquí están los, los spelling rules. Este, tómele una captura de pantalla o tómele foto con el teléfono. Ok, para que lo tengan ahí a mano. Entonces, ahorita vamos a hacer la, el, el listado este, vamos a ir cambiando los verbos. Ok, hoy sí se ve la lista. Yes. 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 ¿La hago un poco más grande? No. Yes. No, ya no lo vemos en el teléfono. Permítame. Control más. ¿Se ve mejor así? Se pierde. Se pierde la primera. Ahí está. Hoy bueno. sí. Hoy sí. Chévere. Now, be being. O sea, solo se le agrega ing al be. ¿Ok? Now, become. ¿Qué dice la, la regla ahí? ¿Qué pasa con los que terminan en e? Se elimina la E y se, se elimina E y se pone I en. Ajá, entonces sería becoming. ¿sí? Becoming. Now, eh, what about begin? Begin. begin. Solo begin. se le agrega, se agrega ING. Ya, beginning. 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 Ok. En break. Plus I. Breaking. 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 Ok. Bring. Bringing. 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 Ok. Se, siempre se le agrega ING aquí. O sea, que van a ser dos ING pegaditas. Ya, bringing. Now, build. Building. Building. Buy. Buying. Buying. Hatch. Hatch. Choose. Choosing. Choosing. Se le quita la E, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Ajá. Y el com. Coming. Coming. Se le quita la E también. Sí. What about could? Putting. 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 Pero Putting. ¿qué pasa con la T? Doble T. Doble T. Excelente. Now do? Doing. 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 Uh, drink? Drinking. 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 Drive? Driving. 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 Se le quita la E, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Eat? Eating. 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 Feel? Feeling. 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 Fight. Fight. Fighting. 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 Finding. Finding. Fly. 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 Forget. Forgetting. 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 Okay. Double T. Uh, forgive. Forgiving. 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 Uh, se le quita la E, ¿verdad? 
Get. Getting. Getting. Doble T. Con doble T. Excellent. Now, eh, give. Give. Giving. Giving. Suprime ¿Y qué le pasa a la E? Suprime la E y agrega. I -N -G. I -N -G. Excellent. Now, eh, go. Going. 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 Ok. Hat. Having. Having. Drop the E. Ok. Se quita la E. Here. Hearing. 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 Heart. Hurting. 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 Keep. Keeping. 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 Grow. Growing. Growing. No. Knowing. 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 Learn. Learning. 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 Live. Living. 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 Excelente. Learn. Learning. Learning. Let. Let. Letting. ¿Qué pasa con la T? Double T. Double T. Ok. Luz. Losing. Ok. Make. Making. Making. Drop me. Ok. Mean. Meaning. Meeting. Meet. Meeting. Meeting. Pay. 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 Put. Putting. ¿Qué sucede con la T? Double T. Double T. Excelente. Read. Reading. Run. Running. Running. Ok. Double. 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 Ok. Say. Say. See. See. Sell. Selling. Selling. Sing. Singing. 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 Similar to bring. Ok. Bring, bringing, sing, singing. Ok. Eh, sit. Sitting. Sitting, double T. Double T. Sleep. Sleeping. Sleeping. Speak. Speaking. Speaking. Spend. Spending. Spending. Stand. Standing. Standing. Still. Stealing. 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 Sweep. Sweeping. 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 Take, taking, taking, drop the e, okay. Teach, teaching, teaching, tell, telling, telling, telling. think, thinking, thinking, typewrite, typewriting, typewriting, typewriting. You drop the e, okay. Understand, understanding, understanding, write, write, writing, without e. Ok, estamos bien. Como ya hicimos la de los verbos irregulares, les va a quedar que ustedes hagan la de los regulares. Recuerden que yo les mandé dos listas. Les mandé las listas de los irregulares y las listas de los regulares. Entonces, como ya hicimos los irregulares, ustedes van a hacer los regulares. Aplicando las mismas, las mismas, este, Rose. las mismas reglas. Ok, las mismas reglas. Any doubts about what you have to do? No. no. Vale. no. Eh, another thing. Este, yo creo que la mayoría son de los de los que les repartí la vez pasada los verbos, ¿verdad? Yes. O hay yes, alguien que no estuvo la última yes. vez que repartí verbos. Mi Usted. ¿Quién fue el último que le di verbos? Era como 40 y yo, algo. Yo. 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 36, 39, 40. 40, ¿verdad? Este, eh, vaya, entonces uh, la persona que dice que falta va a tener read y run. ¿Verdad? ¿Alguien más hace falta? Yo, teacher. Vale, usted va a tener 6 y sí. Ok. 
Vale, ¿Quién más? Mi teacher. Vale, usted va a tener sell y sing. Okay. ¿Alguien más? ¿No? Vale, entonces con esos verbos que tienen ahorita, que, que ya los que tenían antes y ahorita los que les acabo de entregar a los que no tenían, eh, ¿se acuerdan que ustedes estaban haciendo eh, en presente simple? ¿Qué, ¿Qué fue lo que estuvimos trabajando ayer? Ayer. Afirmativas en presente simple, ¿sí? Entonces ahora van a ser afirmativas en presente continuo. O sea que en el caso de Rafael va a decir I am being being I am being a good man. Estoy siendo un buen muchacho, un buen hombre, ¿ok? Ok. Entonces, este... Y lo tiene que hacer en tercera persona también. O sea, con cualquiera de las okay. otras personas, ya sea I, you, we, they. Y con tercera persona, ya sea he, she, or it. ¿Ok? Entonces, los verbos que ya, ya ustedes ya estaban manejando. Igual, en afirmativo, cualquiera de las otras personas más. Teacher, Natalie le escribió algo en el chat. Tercera persona, permítanme. Vaya, entonces usted, Natalie, sería... Nos habíamos quedado hasta sin, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. Entonces usted sería eh, sit y sleep. ¿Verdad? Entonces, este, pueden, pueden entrar a ver eh, los que no estuvieron en la clase de ayer para que vean cómo estuvieron trabajando sus compañeros. Pueden entrar a ver este, el, el, el de YouTube, porque yo ingresé en cada uno de los, de los, a ver cómo estaban trabajando. Y vamos a estar trabajando similar, pero con el presente continuo. ¿Ok? Ok, teacher. Este, necesitan, necesitan que les, que les vuelva a, a, a compartir cómo es que tienen que hacer las... La estructura, please. la estructura, permítanme. Este es del presente continuo, es este, ¿ve? Sujeto más el verbo, más el verbo en ING y después va el complemento. Ok. So, Acuérdese que el de arriba es presente simple y el de, ablajo, el de abajo es presente continuo. El que van a hacer ustedes, presente continuo. El sujeto, verbo to be que le corresponda y el verbo en ing. Acuérdese que para I es am, para you, we, and they es are y para he, she, and it es is. Van a hacer los, las, las oraciones, las van a hacer, como son dos verbos los que tienen, ¿verdad? van a hacer una, digamos, en el caso de Rafa, que era con el verbo to be, este, I am being a good man. She is being a good friend or my friend. And ahí están las dos con be. Y después sería, este, voy a hacer otro para no hacerle todo el trabajo a él. <risa> este, Solo con, right. eh, con, con el con, verbo, con el become, become. Usted tendría que hacer con become, ajá. Pero ajá. en mi caso, vaya, lo voy a hacer con right, que es el último. Vaya, right, ¿verdad? I am writing a novel. He is writing poems. Eh, eso sería con write, los dos con write. Y el, el otro, digamos, work. Este, eh, you are working at the minister, at the ministry, okay? And she is working 
very hard. ¿Ok? Entonces yo ahí ya tengo las cuatro oraciones. O sea, dos con cada verbo. Una con cualquiera de las otras personas. I, you, we o they. Y la otra con tercera persona del singular. Ya sea he, she or it. ¿Ok? ¿Estamos bien? Yes. yes. Perfecto. Entonces ustedes tienen listas esas oraciones. Y si quieren... ¿Verdad? Las hacen eh, también en negativas e interrogativas. Eso no es obligación, solo si quiere. ¿Verdad? ¿Por qué? Porque este, para que usted tenga como para corroborar si su compañero lo está haciendo bien. Lo que, lo que cuando nos pongamos en, en equipos a trabajar como ayer. ¿Verdad? Entonces, este, ¿tienen el fin de semana para hacerlo? Eh, recuérdese que esto es como trabajo extra, extra aula. Siempre continúen trabajando con, sus, con su plataforma, ¿verdad? Acuérdese que la plataforma es la que le da el, el ¿cómo se llama? Eh, su certificado, ¿verdad? Depende del trabajo que usted haga en la plataforma. ¿Ok? Eh, y si tienen cualquier duda o consulta, siempre no duden en escribir en el WhatsApp, ¿verdad? De preferencia en, en, el, en el WhatsApp del equipo, ¿verdad? De, 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 del salón. ¿Por qué porque así no individual? Porque muchas veces la misma pregunta la tienen varias gentes y entonces me es más fácil despegar la duda en un, de un solo en el... En el, en el en el, en el del grupo que estar individualmente contestando lo mismo ¿verdad? es más, si yo estoy ocupada en otras cosas muchas veces sus compañeros eh, le pueden ayudar también ya, ya he visto yo eso ¿ok? ahí salen muy buenas sugerencias este y nos vemos el lunes, see you on Monday have a nice weekend ¿ok? Bye. Take care. Bye bye. bye. bye, bye. I will send you the PPT right now. Okay. Bye bye. Take care. Bye bye. bye, -bye.